Hello everybody, welcome back to our video and today I'm going to be playing Minecraft and I'm going to be showing you some build hacks and tips and tricks. So uh, yeah, let's just uh, get right into it. So the first thing you can do is if you want a stem on your pumpkin, you can have green candles or just a sea pickle. It's pretty smart if you're going to have like some giant pumpkin patch. So uh, yeah, it's uh, kind of a cool little thing so I wanted to share that with you. Next, we have a few bonsai trees. Uh, so this one is basically the one I prefer. You could use a dead bush. Again, you can really customize. I don't know why I used this flower, but, well, I did. So, um, yeah, and there's also this, which, I mean, it's pretty cool. It doesn't make it the most sense, but you can use it. Anyways, next on the agenda, so we have this TNT here. And these red candles here, again, there's a lot of candle madness. You need these red candles as like dynamite sticks. And if we want to, we can take this flint and steel and light it up. Kind of like what this one has. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. So um, if you're ever going mining, just bring candles, I guess. Anyways, on to the next one. So we basically, I don't know, this is, it's nothing much really. It's just a little joke kind of that I made so uh yeah it's basically Phantom Steve I guess um I mean something you can do is like get barriers and make him fly I just thought it was kind of funny so I want to include it in here so Phantom Steve anyway so if we go over here we actually have pretty much a toaster so it's like a black toaster that has some uh burnt toast but uh, I think it's pretty cool um, and, yeah, I think it'd fit in perfectly for your kitchen. There's probably other ways to do it, probably better ways, but this is a really simple one. I mean, you can see that there is a dragon, but it's not the easiest to see, so I'm just gonna eat some cake and enjoy my toaster. Anyways, so if we go over here, we have basically like a sittable chair. So basically all you need to do is you need to grab some trap doors of your choice. And you're gonna want to grab a slab. Uh, any slab you want. I'm just gonna use a spruce slab. You're also going to want a piston. Something to activate that piston. And you're also gonna want a minecart. It, honestly, it doesn't- it's not much. It may seem like it's a lot of stuff, but it's worth it in the end. And you also want a rail to place down the minecart. Alright, so after you have that, you want to place the minecart. And you want to break the rail or other stay here, minecart. You want to break the rail or otherwise it. Oh my gosh. It works fine when I was making that, but of course, when I'm making a YouTube video, it's just not going to work for me. All right, as I was saying, you want to break the rail, not move the minecart. And uh, you want to have some grass going up like this. You want to have a spruce wood slab up here and then place another block and a piston going down like that and a block of redstone and then boom you have that and then you just need to put the final decorations place the trap doors and the door and boom you basically have a suitable chair really cool um i mean yeah it's it's pretty workable and stuff you can use it if you're gonna make like a town hall or something i don't know uh it's just kind of a cool little thing that i made Anyway, so if we go over here, this is kind of a stupid one, but uh, still wanted to share it with you guys. It's basically just like a, it's basically just an umbrella. So I mean, I'm not the most creative in the world, but still a build tip, okay? Anyway, so if we go over here, we have this um, very nice looking house with um, some cauldrons and leaves. So the, basically, this is kind of just a cool little fern sort of thing. And, uh, yeah, and bonus, so you can basically get some leaves, if I can, there. You can get some leaves and not a door. You want to get a trap door. Another thing you can do is something kind of like this. Of course, you could extend this farther, depending on how big your house is, but I just wanted to be kind of lazy and I made that. So, yeah, kind of a cool little, um shrubbery sort of build hack so you know it, it works 
And by the way, guys, all of this works on any version, almost any version, anyways, because I play on Bedrock, and Bedrock and Java are pretty much the same. It's just Java actually has more things than Bedrock, but in this case, like, we can move stuff like chests, so that's cool. Anyways. So if we go over here, um, it's basically like a pool table, so this is basically the stick, and all it is is just some looms, and some trap doors around it, and some green carpet. So, you know, it's, it's pretty good. Uh, kind of cool. So I'll just place that right back up. It's pretty much how to build it. Pretty simple and easy, so, uh, yeah. And over here we have a stove. It doesn't actually work unless you have unless you have Java, and you have these campfires um, still working. Because in our version, um, when a minecart hits the campfire, it'll just break. So yeah, but we can still put put stuff in it. So that's kind of cool. Anyways, I'm going to show you how to build this because um, this seems kind of more complicated. It's not very much though, but uh, yeah. Anyways, so you need stuff like a minecart hopper. That's not how to spell a minecart. Uh, we have. Let's see. We need a trap door. We need something something to make the piston work. And we need dark oak trap door. We also will need. <laughs> there's a lot of things to make some of these. So yeah. And last but not least, we need a campfire. There we go. Alright, now, let me remake this for you guys. Actually, we do need something to burn the campfire, so I'll just get a shovel. And, yeah. You also could use a building block. It doesn't have to be redstone, but uh, I just decided to use redstone. Anyways. So you do this, then do that, and this over here. Wait. Oh, gosh. What am I doing? Yeah, it could just go like that. There we go. Now this is like that, whatever that meant. And we can have, you know, I'm gonna use pistons to stack up here. And... Wait, I'm not doing this very well. You wanna have something kind of like this. And then you're gonna want a piston that will power that. Are you kidding? I moved it. Uh, yeah, let me move this a little... Okay, yeah, it's it's fine. You know what? No, it's not fine. <sighs> Alright, guys, I messed up, so I'm gonna have to fix this. Hopefully you guys did not mess up like I did. Oh, and you all also want to do one minecart at a time. So, there's that too. Anyways. So, we're gonna want to have this like that. And... This like that. And then, boom. There you go. A nice little working... Or, well, it doesn't really work, but it's a nice little stove that you can make. And if you do this, you can basically jump on it because of the trap door part. So, yeah, it's, it's really cool. As long as you don't do this and stuff, I mean, it, it looks like a stove. So, yeah, I'm just going to break this now because I already have one. Anyways, now we can go over here and we basically have some sort of like shipping crates. It's kind of cool, but, uh, yeah, kind of little shipping crates. And by the way, this looks just like an egg. So, if you're shipping eggs, that's perfect. Anyways, chicken. And over here, we basically have, like, a little dog bed. So you can have, like, a bone here. And oh. your, like, dog. Hello, Mr. Dog. And, uh, yeah, it's basically, like, a little bed for him. And if you want, you could grab a cauldron. I don't know how to spell cauldron there. <laughs> cauldron. There we go. And some water. And then... Boom. It's, it's a little water bowl. And if you have a cat, you can do a potion of slow falling. And then... Boom. You basically have milk. But this is a dog, so water. Anyways, moving on. So we basically just have this like little tiny working um, fridge. So basically you just press the button, boom, you get some cooked chicken. Very nice. Press it again, boom, you get some cooked rabbit. Do it again, you get some cooked beef. And you can give it to your dog and make him love you. Alright, now, moving on. 
we have basically this like little just this dining thing <laughs> so basically you can use um, flower pots as well I guess you can say cups but I guess you're drinking hot chocolate or coffee or something you definitely are drinking dirt um, but yeah it's still cool and you can also have a shovel and a, a trident to make it look like you're eating and stuff I don't know why you'd need a spoon for you know beef or whatever alright moving on again so over here is just a little tiny hot tub or something and this can be used as well basically just like shampoo and stuff a uh, body wash and things like that so yeah it's pretty cool just make sure not to step on your shampoo otherwise you'll crush it anyways next so this is kind of a stupid little one but it's a it's a lamp yeah okay next so if we go over here we have like a little tiny computer and you can actually make this working so what you need is a note block now this compute this working computer I will say is not the best working computer in the world but it's it's something anyways we're gonna want to get the button and so for the buttons gonna be like this it's a little bit of redstone but it's like barely any so you should be fine and you do this darn it doesn't work wait why does it not work uh wait will this do it hmm okay I know there is a way to make this like make a little sound uh, I guess we can do like this no okay <laughs> um anyways there is some way to make a working computer apparently I can't figure it out but uh if you like press this polished blackstone button there is a way to make it trigger the note block just apparently isn't gonna work for me because I'm making a YouTube video and they always seem to go wrong. But, uh, yeah, working computer, I guess. It's stupid. Anyways, moving on, we have these two little scarecrows. So, this one scarecrow can basically just look like this. And then this one is covered with moss and uh, some levers. Anyway, so I put some barrier blocks up here, and yes, barrier blocks are in bedrock, in case you did not know. So that's always cool. Anyways, so... Uh, yeah, some cool little things. Pretty fun. And yeah. And last but not least, we have the final thing here, and... We have a bookcase, and you can use, like, these looms in order to make it look empty. And, oh, wait, what's this guy have here? Uh, hey, g give me that book. What's this say? Subscribe! Well, I guess what you guys should do then. Well, this, uh, nice, fine sir tells us to subscribe. So you should probably subscribe to my videos. Or, so, what? You should probably subscribe to me. Um, yeah, and, uh, leave a like, subscribe. As this guy said... And, uh, yeah, I'll see you next video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Um, yeah, Minecraft Build Hacks. Goodbye.